Thanks. And welcome everyone to England's North West. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson and it's all about action from the Premier League in this case it is Manchester United versus Brighton and Hove Albion well Derek when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch particularly in those central areas whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game number 10 Marcus Rashford number seven and here's the lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea starts in goal. Victor Lindelof plays alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. Marcus Rashford starts with Jadon Sancho on the flanks. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. Good luck. Cheers. Thank you. Good game. Good game. Hey, good game. Thanks. Good game. Good. And the team selected for Brighton and Hove Albion. Well, in this shape, unless their wing backs play further forward, there won't be any width in their attacks, which then puts a lot of pressure on the strikers to provide the goal threat. And the contest begins. And a throw in forthcoming. Cristiano Ronaldo. Christian Eriksen now. Scott McTominay. Ericsson. They do pass the ball with authority. Jaden Sancho. You know, when Ronaldo is on the pitch, we tend to think he'll stamp his authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, Derek, he's so dangerous in the air, but it's not just his aerial ability, it's his movement in the box that buys him that little bit of space to get on the end of crosses. Whether it's in front of defenders or drifting in behind them, he always seems to be in the right place. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And he smacks it against the crossbar. Well, I thought that was in, Derek. He struck it so sweetly, plenty of power. Can't come much closer than that. Ericsson. Now with Rashford. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. And that leads to the goal that puts them ahead. And alarmingly, that is a long way off target. Well, possession seeded. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. A bit of running room now on the wing. Crossing possibilities. However, up a dead end. 
Well, what about that opportunity a few minutes ago? We can see it again now. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And the problem not completely solved. A deft clearance. And Welbeck! A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Marcus Rashford. Patient enough build-up. Can they carve out a chance? Malassia. Christian Eriksen now. Cristiano Ronaldo. Pascal Gross. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Can he convert? And a decent save. Full credit. Well, as the stats tell us, Brighton have been second best in terms of possession. But what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. Untidy in possession. It's with Alex Tennis. This is Varane. Bruno Fernandes. Eriksen. Here's Ronaldo. Christian Eriksen now. A good and fair challenge. Welbeck. Alexis McAllister. Good movement. Well, possibilities in the centre. Welbeck! Oh, a moment of pure class! Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Jaden Sancho. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Scott McTominay. Eriksen. Well, you can sense the threat is there. It's with McTominay. Eriksen. A goal! That's exactly what they needed. That should get them believing again. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. In action then and you sense United have the momentum at the moment Tossard 
And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, how often do we say this? Cristiano Ronaldo has struggled to get into the game, not really making much of an impact, Stuart. Well, Derek, he has to impose himself on this game. He's been far too quiet so far. If they are to get back into this... So back underway with United looking to plot a route back into this game. Scott McTominay. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Cristiano Ronaldo. Sancho. Here's Eriksen, putting his body on the line. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? And the defender got the last touch, that'll be a corner. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? Corner kick played in. Just not testing the keeper at all with that cross. Ronaldo feeds it. Oh, a goal! The equaliser! They completely changed the equation. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? So back underway. The game having been squared at 2-2. Pascal Gross and a strong tackle Marcus Rashford Eriksen keeping it moving dynamically and teammates to play it to well the keeper performing brilliantly well that's just incredible he reacted so quickly there Bruno Fernandes, well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. <laughs> 30 minutes left for play. Oh, breezing past him. Alex Tevez. Can he put them in front? A really top-notch piece of defending. And the counter looks on here. Options available. McAllister. How about the cross? Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Malasia. And here is Malasia. Now with Rashford. Malasia. Given away by Manchester United. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. 20 minutes remaining. Cristiano Ronaldo. Eriksen. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Scott McTominay. <laughs> Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Thank you. 
Well back. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, the cross didn't get past the first defender. Ericsson. Can they take advantage? Sancho. A very effective clearance. Ericsson. Tomine. Here's Ericsson. Oh, really close. Just over the top. Stoppage in play and a chance for the referee to go back and retrospectively hand out a yellow card. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number 24, Christian Eriksen. To be replaced by number 17, Fred. Substitution for Brighton and Albion. Coming off the pitch, number 18, Danny Wilder. Coming onto the pitch, number 9, Neil Morpé. Really fine initial touch. Well, time is running out to get this winner, but the fans certainly believe it's coming. Just listen to the noise. What a fantastic finish we could have here. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. Sancho. And here's Fred. Tomine and a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Manchester United know they've got to be precise with the corner given the circumstances. Substitution time it is. And the short option preferred. Rafael Varan. Ronaldo. It's a good looking ball in behind. And just what was needed from the goalkeeper. Well, so late in the game. That's a brilliant stop from the keeper. Big moment for him. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. Manchester United on the front foot in the closing moments. Can they find a winner? And well, he'll take efforts like that all day long. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes.